Hey guys, Linda Bamba here from lindabamba.net. We're searching for how to use the audience insight tools in your Facebook ads manager account. And I'm here um, actually in my account, my ad manager account. If you come over here and if I click audience insights, um, this will pop up if you're we're going to actually create an audience. I'm not going to pick either of these, but you can see here it gives you um, over here you can put all your specifics in like I, if I do I'll leave that at US um, I've been doing my audiences between 25 and 45 you can set this at what you know however you want um, I went both men and women um, and you know you have to put your niche in here mine is the home-based business industry um, I'm gonna put network marketing pro in here and I suggest you use a thing what I call tops to try to, to get um, to pick the pick the companies and people in your niche, which top stands for tools, organizations, people, and publications. Um, that if you when you before you come and use this, that you know you have those written out. You can do it in a notebook, so you can start plugging that in. But you can see here I put Network Marketing Pro in here, and Facebook is telling me that that audience it's 150,000 to 200 active people a month. And they give you these tabs. This is the demographics, the lifestyle, um, relationship, education. What I'm really after, because I'm trying to build a, um, audiences for my Facebook ads, I'll come over here to the page likes. And you can see here, it gives you a list of first top 10 categories. These are all potentially uh, different you know, people, organizations, and stuff that I could target uh, for my audience. Facebook does that gets that information for you. If you come down here, it gives you the page likes. And you're really looking, if you come over here for to the affinity score, you're looking for anything that's over 10x. And you can see here, all of these are coming up. Um, the relevant score, like network marketing press first, but these are all other people, companies um, that I could potentially target. I mean, you can actually click to see more here. It's giving me um, a bunch of them. So I'm going to put one of them. It's telling me Matt Morris because ultimately what you want for a cold, if you're running traffic uh, to a cold offer, you want this to be somewhere between 500,000 K to a million. So I'm going to put Matt Morris in here. And if it's already popped in here, um, Facebook will populate it for you. So he's a public figure. If I put him in, now it just bumped it up to between 200K and 250. So I'm going to keep adding some more things in here to get to 500,000. Let's see what else is here. Tony Robbins. It's. I'm going to put um, the direct, now you can see here there's direct selling news and direct selling association. So I'm going to come back up here and I'm going to put direct selling association. If I click this, come back up. Now I'm up to between 400K and 450. This is active people. So I'm going to go back down here and look at some more. I'm going to try, and actually, I know Kate McShay, her score is over 24. So I'm going to put her in here, see if she populates. Okay, now she's not populating, so it's not in here yet. Um, let's see who else is in here. I'm going to try Smart Networker, see if that comes up. Because really, what you're doing is um, okay, now that doesn't populate. Um, I'm going to try Jim Rohn, which that should populate. Okay, that's going to populate. If I put him in here, okay, now you see this took me over the million mark, which a million is a little bit um, more than I want. So I'm going to try, I'm going to take that out and see where that takes me. I'm between a million and 1.5, that's still a little bit more. So I'm going to take, um, Direct Selling Association now. Okay, now I'm between 900K and a, month, a million. So that's a good, I mean, because I want to be in that 500 to a million range. And what you can do is, if I wanted to, I mean, I'm, I don't want to set up an ad right now. Um, what I can do is, 
I can come up here if I click save and then I can put the audience name actually it's not gonna let me do it hmm. it's just uh, audience Let's see if it lets me save it you can see it's up here um, do audience now Let's see if it lets me save it okay it did let me save it now I, I could check that if I come back over here to audiences and that's the audience I just did. So that's um, a little bit more about the audience insight tool. Um, this is something that you can really give you a lot more information when you're trying to uh, create audiences uh, for your Facebook ads. I mean, they're really giving you um, the page likes are the ones that are really the really important then you can p come over here and populate that st stuff in here and as you're adding it see which is doing then the affinity score down here is the really the um, the most important thing you want looking for things that have affinity scores of over 10x so I hope you found this video helpful um, if you're looking for more free Facebook uh, training you can grab my free cheat sheet uh, go ahead click the link below and I'll see you on the next video